So I've got a little bit of a tale of woe. It's not a big one, but I bought this fan five years ago. I was very pleased with it. I still am pleased with it, actually. And uh, we did review it on Skill Builder. I did a little piece on it. Some people thought it's a great van. Some people don't think it's a great van. But I did know when I bought it, the RAC man said to me, well, we've had a bit of trouble with those. We've recovered a few of them because of the clutch problem. Now, I wasn't happy to hear that, but I just traveled, hopefully, if you like, and it wasn't until Dylan was driving it, the man on the other side of the camera here, when we discovered a problem with the clutch. And what happened is the pedal went down and it stayed down and, and you couldn't release it. You had to actually physically pull the clutch pedal up to release it. And it went on and that didn't happen again for a while. And then it happened again. And then it seemed to happen on a fairly regular basis. So I started putting the feelers out, looking on the forums, doing all the things you normally do to try and find out the answer. And some people said, oh, you need a new slave cylinder, which is inside the bell housing. So that means a gearbox has got to come out. Everything's got to come out. So I've been quoted 800 quid for that. And the guys are saying, well, while we're there, we might as well renew the clutch, even though it's only done 36,000 miles. So that's not a lot in five years, is it really? Um, so I don't know what to do. What I'm after is some advice, because when I look at this fluid, I did actually get some clutch and brake fluid and um, if that slave cylinder inside the housing is leaking you'd expect to see a loss of fluid and to tell you the truth it's lost a tiny bit nothing very much is that enough have you got the answer I would appreciate your help a lot of the time we're giving the advice on skill builder but in this case if you've owned one of these vans you know somebody who's owned it or you know something about them I'd really appreciate you telling me is that the slave cylinder that's causing the problem have I got a part with that 800 quid to get the guy to open it up or is there some simple fix I've just topped this up and it and actually lost a lot more than I thought it was actually empty all around here so you should do it on level ground really uh, so maybe that does suggest that there's some kind of leak inside that slave cylinder. There's nothing happening around the master cylinder. I can't see any leak there. So there you go, another little expense. And by the way, if you've got a two minute tip for us, please send them in because we've got lots of lovely prizes waiting to go out, all packed up and ready for you. And uh, there's all kinds of lovely goodies coming in. So send us your tip, just film it on your phone, very quick and easy and uh, send it in that way, not that way, please. And we, if we use it, we'll send you something nice.